Here's a strategy that can truly save your Airbnb business because as we know, Airbnb can, depending on your marketplace, it can fluctuate. Sometimes you can be super booked and sometimes it can be pretty dry. So this strategy, the mentor mental insurance strategy is one way that it solves uh, this problem, right? Now, there's many things that you can do, right? There's many individuals online giving a lot of in advice uh, and you should follow it uh, if it resonates with you. The reason why I like this strategy is because I know that if I'm able to get this right three times a year, that's all the work I need to do. I don't have to fight for my life with price labs, dynamic pricing tools, tweaking, optimizing, SDR listings all the time, high turnover, etc. Now, I'm not here to be like, oh, like, Airbnb is dead, etc. No, Airbnb is very much alive with respect to the right marketplace. If you're currently getting value from watching this video, you'll want to make sure you take a second and click below to grab the midterm rental insurance blueprint to help accelerate your process in being able to land these midterm rental insurance contracts with respect to your marketplace. Make sure you click the button below and grab it and continue on with the gems in this video. But if you're anything like me and you've experienced some slowdowns in your marketplace and sometimes a headache of being able to know whether, you know, you're gonna get the next booking or not, because sometimes you're just getting them galore and then sometimes it slows down. This is why I'm leaning on this strategy and this is why the strategy has been a game changer because you only gotta get it right once or twice. You don't have to do it over and over and over again and not have a predictable business, right? So the reason why I like the midterm mental insurance route is because if your calendar looks anything like this, where you might have, let me make this red so you can see it. Maybe you got a booking here, booking here, booking here, booking here, booking here, spotty booking. And this is what it looks like. You might be freaking out because you're not making <clears throat> the numbers work for you or your investors. But when you land an MTR contract and you land it, let's say even in December, all the way out into August, which is actually one of the deals that we got, this is booked and busy, which means that you don't have a slow season because you're a hundred percent occupied. And this is the case for many of our properties because we've gone ahead and just completely went all into this model where we can ha easily have our average contract last four months, gone all the way up to eight months, received increase for 12 months, just closed on a contract for six months, just goes on another contract for three months, right? And keep in mind, even if you get one month, it's very, very, very typical that the insurance company starts with one month and then continues to extend with respect to what the damage is on that property, right? So keep in mind, just uh, your first time watching this video and getting familiar with this channel, the way it works is there's a unforeseen event that happens to a property a homeowner is an insurance policy holder files a claim with their insurance company their insurance company works with a temporary relocation company a temporary relocation company will then find homeowners like ourselves who are available who are on airbnb who are corporate housing by owner who are on the databases which these uh, temporary relocation companies live in including their own you want to be on their own database just go to their website enter your property as many times as possible you don't always need pictures right and then we're here then they offer then they inquire or they reach out or you reach out to them and you build that relationship it'll start with a month contract but here's the caveat right if it's um anything like water damage and can take anywhere from up to um you know uh geez anywhere from like three to five months if it's anything like uh fire it's anything from six to eight months right so when you know this and they start with one month you are very well aware that you're probably going to have these family locked in for the next three months which means that you've done the job one time and you've secured the bag for the next three months for the next four months for the next six months and keep in mind that they typically extend because work takes longer. So when you do this strategy, this strategy can truly save your Airbnb business if you're an owner, property manager, co-host, right? Arbitrage, 
this will give you that peace of mind. Now the next question is, hey, how do I get these back to back and over and over again? Well, there's multiple ways to do this. Uh, one is you wanna be visibility, availability is everything. Then it's optimization of your current listings and then it's relationship building. Uh, you wanna build these relationships in a long-term game. You cannot build a relationship overnight, but you can start optimizing for one. You can show up at the bar, right? Uh, you can show up and send an email. You can show up and make a call. That is how you start building relationship. There is an easy way where you can get an inquiry and you lock the deal down. There, that happens very often. But then there is the also the um, calculated way where you're not only putting your property into databases, one of many databases, but you're also doing the work to build the relationship. You cannot go wrong if you do that and then also have your exit strategy as a short term rental. The biggest tip I will give is you do not want to only have one listing. If your listing looks like this, you will not have the availability to house someone that looks like this. Either you duplicate that listing or you create a second profile that allows you to have complete availability so that when someone comes and books, they actually have the ability to look on your listing and see that there's a six month runway, three month runway or fourth month runway. Because if it looks anything like this, they won't see availability, which is the fundamental, most important pillar is to be available for these insurance companies. If they're in your database, they'll reach out and let and ask if you're available. Now, I don't know about you, but if someone reaches out and asks if I'm available and I have this going on, I'll find a way to make it work by removing or placing these people elsewhere. But that's also why you don't want to be too far extended out and you want to do a lot of uh, calendar management, which again is covered in another video. But it's very important that you understand that you only got to get it once, twice, or sometimes even less than that to secure your occupancy and profitability in this space. If you got value from watching this video, make sure that you watch the next one that is, says two extra income by implementing the midterm rental insurance strategy now uh, to again, do just that. Secure that bag and make sure that you reach your goal 